Good afternoon. In this lecture, we will discuss structure activity relationships of cholinergic blocking agent and synthesis of some selected drug. Structure activity relationship of cholinergic antagonist, also uh, known as muscarine antagonist. So, this is the basic uh, skeleton for the muscarine antagonist. What will happen when the substitutions are carried out at R1, R2, R3 position? by various substitutions uh, substituent and what will be the effect on the duration of action and their biological activity for the potent cholinergic antagonist the group r1 and r2 must be hydrophobic in nature like phenyl cyclohexyl cyclopentyl okay in the above general structure of for amino alcohol the Substituent R1 and R2 should be a carboxylic or a heterocyclic ring for maximal antagonist potency. Means to obtain the maximum antagonist potency, the R1 and R2 should be substituted with carboxylic or heterocyclic ring. Next, the ring may be identical, but the more potent compound have different rings. The one ring is aromatic and other may be saturated or possessing only one olefin bond like propanthaline. Their ability to do these effectively is because of the large group of R1 and R2 that enhance the binding to receptors since the antagonists are larger than agonist. The R3 substituent may be a hydrogen atom, hydroxyl group, hydroxymethyl group or a carboxyamide for it may be a component of R1 and R2 ring system. When the substituent is hydroxyl group or hydroxyl methyl group, the antagonist is usually more potent. The X substituent in the most potent anticholinergic agent is an ester. Let's see in the basic skeleton X but an ester functional group is not absolute necessary for muscarine antagonist activity very true the nitrogen substituent is a quaternary ammonium salt in the most potent anticholinergic agent the tertiary amine also possess antagonist activity presumably by binding to the receptors in the cationic form Generally, alkylic, generally uh, the alkylic substitution are methyl group, ethyl group, propyl or isopropyl group. Okay. The distance between the ring substituted carbon and amine nitrogen is apparently not critical. So as much as the length of alkyl chain connecting this may be from two or four carbons. The most potent anticholinergic agent has two methylic units in its chain. Let's uh, discuss uh, the synthesis of some anticholinergic drug. The first drug is ipratropium bromide. The ipratropium bromide uh, can be synthesized by the reaction between atropine and the bromopropane with the loss of hydrogen bromide resulting in the synthesis of ipratropium bromide properties it is a white or almost white crystalline powder freely soluble in methanol soluble in water but slightly soluble in ethanol medicinal uses it is used in the inhalation therapy to produce dilation of bronchial smooth muscle for acute asth asthmatic attacks it produces bronchodilation by competitive inhibition of cholinergic receptor bound to the smooth muscle of the bronchioles. So uh, this is the medicinal uses and synthesis of uh, ipratropium bromide as the anticholinergic drug. So next drug we have a uh, dicyclomine synthesis. The dicyclomine can be synthesized uh, by the reaction dibromopentane by uh, 
uh, when uh, dibromopropin uh, pentin is treated with benzyl cyanide and sodium amide yes resulting in the synthesis of a new intermediate further this intermediate is uh, treated with ethanol okay and uh, resulting in the synthesis of new intermediate further and this intermediate is treated with the formaldehyde sodium and diethylamine with the loss of a sodium uh, ethoxide resulting in the synthesis of a new derivative which is further treated with plat uh, platinum based catalyst and resulting in the synthesis of dicyclomine so this is the general reaction for the synthesis of dicyclomine properties it exists as a white crystalline powder with bitter taste soluble in water and chloroform so this is the general properties medicinal uses diclosopamine hydroclide behaves both as an anti muscarine and non specific anti spasmodic agent minimize the adverse effect associated with the atropine types of compound dicyclomine has spasmolytic effect on various smooth muscle spasms particularly those associated with the gastrointestinal tract so these are the medicinal uses of uh, dicyclopamine dicyclomine next uh, we have a procyclidine hydrochloride very important drug uh, how we can synthesize the procyclidine hydrochloride the acetophenone is treated with the uh, formaldehyde with tetrahydropyrrolidine the name of the reaction is uh, many condensation in the presence of acetic acid resulting in the, in the synthesis of a new intermediate which is pyrrolidone propiophenone further this intermediate is treated with the uh, cyclohexyl magnesium bromide cyclohexyl magnesium bromide hydrolysis is carried out and uh, resulting in the synthesis of procyclidine hydrochloride or procycline procyclidine so this is a general reaction for the synthesis of uh, procyclidine hydrochloride if we see uh, the properties it exists as a white crystalline powder and it has been used for peripheral effect that are similar to methathenylin medicinal uses it its clinical usefulness lies in ability to relieve voluntary muscle spasticity through its central action procyclidine is used in the treatment of parkinson disease generally it is used in the treatment of uh, parkinson disease okay so the synthesis of uh, anticholinergic agent may be asked in the examination uh, any uh, discuss any uh, one drug any any one anticholinergic drug with their medicinal uses so this is important for examination thank you